Our next guest is a comedic powerhouse. Craig Robinson burst onto the scene as Daryl in the hit NBC show, The Office. Uh, and then he went on to make us laugh as the, the Pontiac Bandit, Doug Judy in Brooklyn Nine-Nine. <laughs> well, now Craig is back as well, <laughs> Craig, and, and Peacock's killing it. In the first season, Craig went on the hunt for snakes to win a contest. Well, now Killing It is back for season two. Craig is here to talk all about it. Good morning, good Craig. Morning. It is so good, good to morning. see you. Good Thank morning. You, you, know, uh, you know, before we get into the show, uh, we, we, we got that sad news about the passing of Andre Brower, who was such a, a stalwart and mainstay in, in Brooklyn Nine-Nine. You were on the show. What was it like with him working? With uh, you know, I looked up to him for a long time. I, I love working with him. He was very kind. He would... Uh, He'll be blasting hip hop from his room. <laughs> he he was awesome, just an awesome individual. What a talent! What a what a great man! What a loss, you know. Yeah. Yeah. What a loss indeed. Um, let's let's talk about your show for a moment because you've you've put Peacock on your back. <laughs> <laughs> You're carrying the streaming network now. Killing it is killing it. As Al mentioned, hundred percent on Rotten Tomatoes. Yeah. Oh wow! So first season, you win the snake contest. Second season, it looks like you're trying to figure out what to do with the winnings. For folks who haven't seen it, here's a little clip. Bigger smile. Bigger. Come on, think about all the snakes you killed. No, I didn't like killing snakes. The magazine sent over bio that said... I was broke and I entered the contest. I used the winnings to start building my empire, but it was horrifying. Okay, then think about your empire. Think about how rich you are. Think about how much more money you have than every other person in this room combined. Come on, man, that doesn't make me smile. I mean, it's only five people here. <laughs> <laughs> That's one thing I've always enjoyed about your acting. Like, you're, you're so good, it doesn't seem like you're actually acting. It seems like yeah. you're playing versions <laughs> of your real self. That's good. But in season two, what can folks expect? Uh, well, we, um, you know, season one, it was uh, all about the snakes and, and winning this contest. So we actually won the contest. So season two, we bought the farm for the uh, uh, salt palmetto berries. So, so everything looks great, and then, uh, then it doesn't. Oh. <laughs> and the thing is, the show also addresses some other issues, you know, capitalism, uh, classism, kind of parallels a lot of the issues going on right now. Why was that important to get that in as well? It's so relatable mm. to everyone, you know, uh, um, especially, you know, after the pandemic, then a bunch sure. of different strikes going on. So it's all about uh, uh, trying to get that, you know, that American dream and, and make mm. that dollar. Mm. You also had to learn sign language for this role. Yes. A little bit of sign. I've done it with my kids. You know, like, we still, like, to this day, all done, all done. You know, but you say it opened up a whole new world for you. It's a whole different, yeah, it's a whole different world. And, it's, uh, and I need to stay with it more so I can be better. Uh, but uh, I have an incredible uh, a coach. And, and, and I learned a little bit in college. I just learned, like, the alphabet and stuff. So I had a small base. But, yeah, it's very intense. Mm -hmm. And, and in the, you know, you've, you've had these great comedic roles. But... I, we're, we're told that your love of comedy started out with the very simple story of the three little pigs. <laughs> <laughs> the three little pigs, yeah. My, my father was uh, uh, having me read the three little pigs one day. And and for whatever reason, I started improvising. Like, okay. like you know, I remember saying, uh, uh, you know, the, the, the house, the pig's house got blown down. And, the, yeah. and then he put on his gym shoes and ran away. My father just was cracking up. <laughs> oh, that's what did you say? Called my I was seventeen. And my father. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> I was I don't know, five, six. That's right. so cool. But, uh, but, uh, but uh, he called my mother in to you know come listen to listen what he says. You know he put on gym shoes. Right. So it was. Uh, yeah, and the more they was, reacted, that's the that's more you reacted. Again. Yeah. <laughs> but in addition to the comedy and the that's acting, so you're apparently quite the musician. Let's talk about. And again, I'm not making this up. The name of the band is the Nasty Delicious. Yes, sir. Yes. And played, if you've heard them, it is aptly is it Nasty, Nasty Delicious. delicious? <laughs> yeah. You played in Chicago recently in your hometown. What was yes, that Yes, yes. Oh, it was, it was fantastic. We went back and sold out the park Can West. we bring that picture back up? Is that <laughs> Nasty like, Delicious. Yeah, yeah. Like sexual chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> like, that there you mean? go. Yeah, that was, that was my, my, uh, my fam. My, my brother is actually uh, uh, in the band with me, Chris Robb, and then... The rest of how become my brother and my sister, Lakeisha, in there. So, um, yeah, we, we were just in Chicago, played the Park West. It was very nice, successful, and we were happy to be there. And we'll be in uh, L.A. at the Troubadour on Ooh. May 8th. Oh, All, okay. right. All right. All right. Any hey. plans to bring it to New York? Absolutely. All right. We'll get here. Let us come play the studio. You should nasty oh, boys yes. to come play. Do a little concert. Okay. Say yes. All right. Nasty Say delicious. Yes. Yeah, you Love go. Which also it. happened to be Craig's nickname in high school. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> 
season two of Killing well It played. is out now on Peacock. Well hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.